there we have it. Good evening, everybody. <laughs> Good evening, everybody. This is Beer ASMR, and tonight I will be opening the Crown Zenith Elite Trainer Box plus the Pokemon Center edition of the Elite Trainer Box for Crown Zenith. Today is actually the release day, and it arrived today from the Pokemon Center, so I was pretty happy about the timing. Crown Zenith is the English version of the uh, V-Star Universe set in Japanese, or I guess the set inspired by the V-Star Universe set. If anyone's been following openings of those, it has been pretty incredible. There's a lot of really nice art, um, so this is very exciting. This. The release of this set um, also marks some changes that are happening to Pokemon cards. Namely, there's a price increase in boosters and Pokemon TCG products, but ETBs are also going to have more packs now. The regular ETB, I believe, will have 10 instead of 8 packs, and now the Plus has 12 instead of 10. These are the items that are included inside. The list over here. I haven't purchased a Pokemon Center of an Elite Trainer box before. I opted for this one because Lucario is pretty cool. I also wanted to do something special for the release of Crown Zenith. This one doesn't have art inside like they tend to have. Usually there's the art that's included on the front of the boosters. So look at the outside of the box. Here we have the player's guide. includes information on the set and then like a master list of the cards. But you can get a glimpse here of some of the really neat art. These are the new um, Gaylor Gallery cards. They're marked by a double G. Like the Trainer Gallery cards have the TG. And then these just include really nice full art, I guess. Um, these include really nice art of, of a bunch of Pokemon. I actually bought several of these cards in Japanese because I really just wanted to own some of it. Um, and they're not guaranteed pulls, of course. These are so lovely. This right now is the most expensive card in the set. I believe when I looked um, earlier today, it was over $100 on TCG Player. This one's probably very sought after, not just because it's very cool art of Mewtwo, but because in the Charizard UPC, one of the promo cards included is the perspective of Charizard in this battle. So this is the Mewtwo's perspective and owning both cards is really nice for a collector. Just another glance. Alright, let's get this open. Whoa. This version of the box comes with a deck box to hold a full deck. So if you're playing with a Lucario deck, you can have this really cool deck holder for it. We have metallic condition markers. 
The usual plastic B star marker. Metallic gold dice. Oot, a metallic. Lucario coin. Here is the Lucario V Star promo. cool alternate art this is sword and shield promo number 291 a block of energy cards Ooh, one of the cool things about crown zenith is that you can get holographic and reverse hollow energy cards in the set now so they can show up in the reverse hollow spot, and then I guess in the holographic spot. It'll be fun to get some of those too. Alright, we have the Lucario sleeves that are like the typical ones, except they are gold inside. Super clean looking. Dividers. And the boosters. out of the way. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Hoping for some first pack magic. The first pack of Crown Zenith. Of course, we have Sacian and Zamazenta. the same on all of the packs, which I think is kind of nice actually. Here we go. Whoops. One, two, three, four. I <laughs> didn't mean to show the color of my card. Alright, starting off with a grass energy. Friends in Hisui. Carnivine having a laugh. Rescue carrier. Cricketot, Aaron, Riolu, very fitting, Screlp, I like the art on this one, and we have a Tangrowth, this is the final card, a rare, non-hollow rare, oh I like this art of Tangrowth, and I'm not sure that I have any Tangrowth Starting off with a V-Star marker. Hopefully that's a good sign. Dusclops. Energy switch. Crocorock. Snow vent. Rock rough. Tangela. Or Tangela. And Tangrowth. 
Tingler with a berry. So cute. Bell toy. Whoop. Galarian Meowth. <gasps> nice. Oh. So this is one of the Galarian Gallery cards. We got a Swablu. This is beautiful. Look, it has a slight hollow effect. This is lovely. Oof, set this aside. <laughs> and we have a Betty Beauty. What's this? Interesting. We've got a hollow trainer with this mysterious symbol. Or mysterious symbols. Plural. Cool. Well, I haven't seen those in any of the opening videos that I've watched so far. If anyone knows what that is, I'm very interested. This panicked me off. Art. One, two, whoop, three, four. Starting off with a dark energy. Later on, well, we have Aaron. It's a nice art of Laron. Friends in Sinnoh. Gloom. What's happening to Gloom? <laughs> what has befallen our friend Gloom? Maybe the Oddish card tells the story. Have we got an Oddish yet? Starly. A flock of Starly. Scyther. Oh, the art is really nice. Even for like the common cards. Ooh. Fierce Young Goose. A Cheery Cherubby. A reverse hollow Lux Ray. And a Rayquaza V. Alrighty. Number 100 out of 159. Sick. Pretty good so far. Energy Retrieval. Shinx playing with a book. By the way, do you guys prefer when I hold it up closer to the art like this? You don't see the abilities, but you get a better look of the art. Or do you prefer um, a full view of the card? Let me know in the comments. I'll be doing a mix of both. Larvesta. I don't know this Pokemon. I haven't seen it. Ponyard. Ooh, I like this. It's a Yukamori. This is a super cute little figurine of Ponyard. Wilmer. Getting too close to the shore. Oh, now we're our troubled friend Gloom again. And Volcarona. Huh. I'm having a hard time figuring out what that is. But it evolves from our friend Larvesta. Is it like a ladybug? No. Moving on to the fifth pack. One, two, three, four. All right, psychic energy. Luxio, and we have Luxray already. Luxio hugging a little greed and plushy. We have Shinx too. The Digging Duo. Shaman. Corefish. Energy Search. Scyther. Riolu. Young Goose. A Reverse Hollow Energy Search. And a Pengoro non hollow bear. Very cool art of Pengoro. What's he thinking about? Alright, 
one, two, three, four, another V star marker, maybe another omen. A good one. <laughs> Lunatone, Rescue Carrier, Salazzle, Ponyard, Seal, Rock Buff, Aaron, Riolu, Reverse Hollow Luxray, and a Zamazenta V. Alright, not bad. Number 98 out of 159. But these actually do still have the symbols. The Scarlet and Violet is going to be transitioning to codes as the identifiers for sets. We're halfway. Starting off with a fire energy, crushing hammer, dust claws, trekking shoes, cherubi, starly, switch, execute. I love this Pokemon. This is pretty cool. They're like crossing this little bridge. I'd be this one. <laughs> love this. Pikachu card! I've got the Galarian Gallery Pikachu, which I just watched a video this morning. Um, I was watching a Danny Phantom video, and he was talking about the Japanese one. You can only get these uh, specific... Oops, here's B. <laughs> Another hollow trainer with more symbols. He, Danny Phantom was saying you can only get these um, cards, like there are some that you can only get in a god pack um, in Japan, so got lucky here. They can show up in the reverse hall of spot. So happy to have that one. I'm still trying to think on how to organize my cards. If I should just have a binder full of the trainer gallery and I guess Taylor gallery cards. Since, um, I mean, I just like looking at them. But does it get boring if you have a binder with only good stuff? I don't know. What do you guys do? Alright, starting off with a fighting energy. Another Carnivine. A Giraffe Rig. <laughs> One of my favorites in Pokemon Go. Energy Switch. It's just so fun to find. Starly. Scyther. Pokeball. Young Goose. Cherubi. A Dragalge Reverse Hollow, which evolves from the Skrelp. And an enamorous non hollow rare. Cool art though. I talk um, a lot about Pokemon Go in my videos. What's this? <laughs> Sorry. Sorry if that's been bothering anyone. <laughs> um, I'm gonna include my friend code. I'm gonna put it on the screen. Um, and I will also put it in the video description if anyone wants to add me. I think there's still a limit on how many friends you can have, but I'm not at the max, so... One, two, three, four. Not the best gift giver in the game, but I've been trying to be better about it recently. <laughs> Alright, we're starting off with a dark energy. And then we have a great ball. Trekking Shoes, Luxio. Is there another Luxio? Hmm. Larvesta. It's like a different art. Tang Tangela. Bell Toy looking sleepy. Galarian Meowth. Wilmer. Ooh, nice! We got a hollow? I think, is it hollow or reverse hollow? Hmm. Anyway, it's a fighting energy though that looks really cool. I'm happy to have it. And in the final spot, Whale Lord. Whoa. Non hollow rare. Just three 
more packs to go. Alright, another V star. These packs have been kind to us. Shaman to start. Crushing Hammer. Dusclops. Emolga. Love Disc. Chetot. Sleepy Chetot. Nyanma. Ponyard. Ooh. A full trainer, full art trainer, a full art trainer, Roxanne. Um, oh, it's not a full art, actually. It's a Galarian Gallery, number 66 out of 70. Cool. She's in some kind of natural history museum. Oh, this is such a beautiful card. I love it. Oh my gosh, the pearls are great so far. <laughs> and we have a Zero Aura V Star. Oh my gosh so pretty. Ah, oh my gosh, such a variety of like different rares that you can pull. That's so exciting. I love it. Got the Hollow Trainers Galarian Gallery or Galler Gallery. <laughs> Starting off with a water type energy. Oh, I haven't moved this yet, but that's okay. Lost vacuum, electric, ultra ball, shanks, happy little shanks. So there are, there's multiple art of shanks and his evolution. Corefish, ponyard, seal, rock rough, rock rough. <laughs> A Turtwig! Oh my gosh, my third one of these! <laughs> the bones with the single little baby Pokemon. Keller Gallery number 31 out of 70. Whoa! <laughs> and in the final spot, a Hollow Nessa. Are these her signatures, maybe? This, this one looks like a signature. This is very nice. Wow. Okay. I don't know if I'm just getting lucky or like the pull rates on this are very good. <laughs> that makes me excited to buy more. Like, wow. You know, I don't care so much about the value, but like pulling these, these, uh, pulling cards with really nice art and so much variety, like that's what makes this hobby so exciting. One, two, three, four. All right. Last pack, we've got the Steel Type Energy, Trekking Shoes, Friends in Sinnoh, Laron, Cricket Tot on the Log, Shanks with a Book, Galarian Mr. Mime. Hmm. They look like they're in the same place, like in the same universe. <laughs> they're in like a 2D platformer. <laughs> Well, it doesn't look 2D, but it's like that kind of world. Sunkern. Coughing. A reverse hollow Bidoof. Enjoying a stump. And final card of the night. A non hollow rare Taurus. Cool. Alright. Oh, well. <laughs> well, let me review the pulls then. Lots of pulls, I think. Pretty decent. We had like some double hits, I think, and some packs. So I just double checked and like the whole video I've been saying Galar Gallery and it's the Galarian Gallery, y'all. So this is the Galarian Gallery. <laughs> Turtwig. Um, 31 out of 70. Look at that happy boy. I love it so much. And we have Nessa, 136 out of 159, Hollow Rare. A Zero Aura V Star, 55 out of 159. 
Roxanne from the Galarian Gallery, number 66 out of 70. Look at her eyes. Lovely. The Hollow Energy card. The Pikachu, number 30 out of 70 from the Galarian Gallery. This is so precious. And we've got B. Number 123 out of 159. Zamazenta V, 98 out of 159. Rayqu Rayquaza, Rayquaza, whatever your preference is. Number 100 out of 159. And finally, no, not finally. <laughs> and we've got Be Betty. Um, Betty. 124 out of 159. And finally, the Swablu from the Galarian Gallery, number 27 out of 70. This is just such a beautiful card. I'm really happy with the Galarian Gallery pulls and all the rest as well. But I'm definitely most excited about these. Sometime soon I'll make a video of the cards that I've purchased from Japan and a lot of singles that I've purchased from TCG Player as well, of other Trainer Gallery cards, both English and Japanese. Thank you so much for watching. I hope it was a relaxing time for you, and I hope you have a good, good sleep. Good night.